What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Starting this one off at a Walgreens. Last time we hit a Walgreens, we found some exclusive cars. Let's see if this store has them too. All right, every so often you find a Walgreens that just has no toys and this seems to be one of them. All right, let's try a Publix. I think most of them are gonna probably have Spring Series, but I could be wrong. Yeah, I mean, it's totally possible that I do find one with like a fresh C case, but I wouldn't bet on it. It doesn't look like the aisle has anything. Let's see if we could find an end cap. And every so often you also find a grocery store that has no Hot Wheels. All right, Dollar Tree. I guess I'm just looking for the Matchbox Porsche at this point. Not sure why I bother with Dollar Tree, honestly. I don't even know when I've ever gotten anything at a Dollar Tree. All right, we're trying out a Publix. I've only been here once or twice, and the first time I ever came here, we found an eight fair treasure hunt. I'm pretty sure this is the store. Once again, we're seeing if we can find a fresh C case, or D case, but I think we're just gonna find the spring mix. Here they are, and I was right. There's, it's pretty empty here, actually. More than other stores, but we have spring mix, and that's really it, some old B case stuff. I think we're gonna see these for a while. I'm not sure. It might just be one wave, but we'll have to see. Let's check the rest of the store. All right, here's the rest of them. Yep, it's just remnants of B case and like one mini hanging out here. Nothing exciting. Waiting for C case to hit. I want to find a fresh C case. It's always at the grocery store where I find the cars I missed at Walmart and Target. So we are waiting for that. All right, third time's a charm. Let's try another Publix. I have a feeling this one gets less traffic it's like in a weird place where you kind of just drive by it and the parking lot's not as full. I'd be willing to bet there's a bunch of WRXs here if they got spring mix. Hopefully it's not just spring mix though. Okay, well, this is the aisle. What did I say? The store's gonna have... Hey, it caught that. It's gonna have... Hey, it caught that. It caught that. Yeah, so there's really nothing here. I don't know, I don't know. All right, checking out this Target. Probably nothing here, but I'm waiting for a C case. I've yet to see C case on the pegs. It has to be coming soon. Let's see, Porsche Majorette set. Haven't seen that in a while. All right, someone told me to make sure I digital. You told me to look, so I'm gonna look. Trust me, I always do look. It's just always the same stuff, so. But if it makes you happy, for me to definitely make you know that I definitely looked. There you go. All right, so I think this side is already done. Ooh, dude, this is new. Yo, I'm a big fan of the RC Hot Wheels, guys. I have the Batman, the Tesla, and the Porsche. This one is in the future for sure, the Nissan Z. And the Hummer is the only other one. I don't really care about the Hummer, but we're getting that. Leave a comment if I should get it. Also, like this video, guys. I'm seeing really nothing here on this side. Just a mess. I'm gonna clean it up a little bit. Get these cars back on the pegs. I don't know what happened over here. Maybe this will give me some good karma to find that Porsche on the pegs. Someday. Someday. I don't know. Someday. It could happen. It could definitely happen. Any new premiums? No, no new two packs. Still waiting for the WRX two pack. I hope we find it. I really hope we find it. Premiums are the same. And what case? More B case. That's weird. How'd that get here? C. Okay, okay. Did they get a C here? Somehow made it to the aisle. Just one car. B. Hmm. So weird. Buy one, get one, 25% off. Hmm. All right, well, we had to stop and check. Always gotta look, guys. Always gotta look. Walmart. All right, so we got a dump in here. This is probably the C case. Something that all these stores got. So we'll look through that and see if we can find anything we don't have. Maybe another Miata, that would be cool. I'd like to find another one of those. I'll come back to this. Let's go check the pegs. In the last video, we got a bunch of cool premiums. Wait, what is this? This is from like end case. Yeah, did they get an end case here? It looks like they actually might have because this is also from end case. That's interesting. Here's the also from end case. It looks like they got an end case. 
That's definitely interesting. Unless these were buried somewhere, there's the bolide. This is definitely an end case. Dude, what else is here? Another bolide. This is some good end case cars. What the heck? Well, that's the strangest thing I've seen in a while. Potentially a fresh end case. Yep, there's another car, the Toyota Tacoma truck, the blue wheels, another bolide, Civic. Yeah, this is like a full end case on the pegs here. Very strange. Alright, well I'm not really interested in anything here. So there's some neon speeders. Oh, 350Z. What else? Another S2000. We got two of those. There's the Integra. Skyline. RX-7. I gotta get the RX-7. And the Celica. I'll say a good amount of them here, just not the Datsun. So I don't really need the Skyline. I'll leave that behind. Wait, there's a new Ford Ranger. Sorry, I got distracted right there. I haven't seen that anywhere else. I guess I'll get these two. Maybe I'll, I'll get all three. We're gonna, we're gonna think about these. 350Z, Mazda RX-7, and the custom Integra mini set here. All right, that's a pretty good stock. Let's see what they got for premiums. Any Fast and Furious? There's another Back to the Future. And then a Forza RS 1800. I've never seen that either. What are these? Fast and Furious. Okay, so I haven't seen any of these cars at all. Grand National Camino. That's the one with the Jetta. Okay. Oh, look. Here they are. Yes. Dude, the NSX. No way. Two NSXs. Three NSXs. Oh, that's awesome. That is so awesome. Oh my god, look how many of these they have. They're all open now. That's pretty cool. Between two videos, we've gotten nearly every single card of the set except for the Skyline. I actually really like this Escort. It's really nice. I don't know why I've never seen it. I guess it's out of the pop culture, much like the Back to the Future car. One of the ones I really wanted to open, to be honest, but I gave it to TJ because I knew he really liked it. So that was sent in by BL Bricks, which is very cool of him to do. We hit again back to back videos. I don't know if I want two of these NSXs though. I kind of want one for opening. I kind of want one to open. Right? It's like, will I ever see it again? I don't know. I don't think it really matters. I'm, I'm kind of over like keeping carded premiums, guys. Like, I'm probably going to keep doing it still, but I really want to open them. I'd rather open this, to be honest with you. Hmm. Oh, look, here is an OG Back to the Future car. The first one. The one we've not seen in larger scale. Uh, there's a lot of good stuff here, guys. There's a lot of good stuff here. I'm actually impressed with the selection. I'm finding it in this Walmart. This thing's quite heavy. 71 Plymouth Hemi Cuda is, is destroyed. Wait a minute. That's not a chase, is it? No. It would stay in the box, I think, right? Pretty sure it does. Porsche Carrera GT. Yeah, no, it's not a chase because the other one's right back there. Look at this groovy thing here. 66 Ford Mustang Fastback. Flower power, definitely cool. And this Carrera GT is sick, dude. Rest in peace, Paul Walker. Rest in peace, my guy. The hunt is over, it was another good one. We hit back to back. I figured if I hit another Walmart close to the video where I found the beginnings of the Fast and Furious set that I probably would find it again. I just didn't know how soon, but I found the NSX, that's so cool. I'm in love with this thing. Right here I have the white one. I think this came out of what? The Mountain Drifters pack, I believe. I'm pretty sure it's one it came from. And now we got the black one to go with it. I think I like the black one better. The windows aren't tinted on this and you can see that it's got a red interior. It's also got some red badges on it. That's definitely cool. This one has it too. So yeah, we got two of them. One I think I'm gonna open and I'm probably gonna give one to TJ. I know he'll really appreciate this. He loves his Hondas. I don't know, like I said, I just don't I just don't care about keeping them carded anymore. I wanna open this for the beginning of the video, but that's also gonna give away the most exciting part, so I probably will not. Maybe I'll open this. Yeah, we'll do that. So we got the 95 Mazda RX-7 Drift Neon Speeders. This thing is super cool. Oh, it's got a red bottom. I didn't even realize that. Green wheels, green and pink stickers on the side with some Japanese. Love it. Absolutely love it. I absolutely love the RX-7s. And then I picked this up for TJ. I put the others back. Neon Speeders are just too expensive to buy the whole set. I'm just not that interested in them. $4 a car is, is a lot. It's a lot. 
But yeah, we got the 01 Accurate Integra GSR, yellow and black. I had picked this up once in a video. I actually deleted the footage accidentally, so you never saw it. But I ended up putting it back. But then I mentioned to TJ how I put it back, and he was like, bro, if you ever see that again, please get it for me. And as you can see, guys, just in case you didn't know, it is the same casting as this one here. See you in the next one.